again two in one day I don't know what's going on anyway we're going to stick first of all first of all right first of all thank you everybody for subscribing and commenting and, and watching the stuff I mean who would want to watch some old fella farting on about beer this beer buffoon is very happy that you do though so please continue to do that the the um the music one i put on with it with the, the europe foreigner white snake 400 views so far i'm astounded that's fantastic and the beer i had before wasn't bad so i had one more for dessert no that's a song line <laughs> the beer i had for that that might that uh brad guitar that mild spot on the last video i did this one this is that was just so nice you've got to you've got to try that but i thought well we'll stick with the organic theme and uh, from the same shop in knighton i found this one <clears throat> sammy smith's pale ale organic pale ale there's the the yorkshire crown on the top my dad was a yorkshireman so i'm kind of sort of we used to drive past the brewery on the way to, to my grand's in, in uh, she lived in York, this is in Tadcaster we used to go that way before motorways were invented even in a Morris Oxford was the first one that I remember going in I think, and then there was various other old cars Vauxhall Victors um, oh yeah all sorts of stuff uh, you get... <laughs> when my granddad died, of course my dad was left some money, so he got a posh new Volvo 440 then one of those little stubby oh he thought it was the bees and easy did he loved it anyway i digress this is samuel smith's organic pale ale three pound 59 god yeah, the yorkshireman in me don't like that <laughs> brewed in tadcaster fermented in stone yorkshire squares now you can see there the picture is the beer fermenting and all that's surrounding it is stone so it's, it's a hard rock beer. Yes. <laughs> um, it captures the true soul of beer, this does, it says. Brewed with hard well water, best organic malted barley, yeast and organic aroma hops. Fermentation in stone Yorkshire squares. Creates a full-bodied, rounded palate that goes well with good food. It has a fresh maltiness that reminds you that good beer is a product of the soil organically nurtured the soil flavoured beer hmm there's a thought they put anything else in it so you might as well have soil flavoured beer <clears throat> we shall see anyway there's, there's a lot going on on that label and uh, what uh, percentage is it 5% so it's not bad it's not bad other videos just uploading so we'll, we'll put them both on at the same time you have a treat double trouble yeah, double feature. There we go. Into the glass. This is a pale ale, so... Oh, I love that noise. There we go. And, well, to be honest, it's not that much different a colour to that bitter I had before. Slightly. Oh, do you know what? That's a big bottle, really. It won't fit in the pint glass. Look at that. Right. It's not a lot different to the beer I had before. It's, it's not so much a pale ale. It's a bitter. Anyway. Same colour. Little bit of carbonation going on in there. Not a lot. One finger head. Nice and fluffy. And this is another one that smells like a beer. So, this is going to be good. Mmm. Mmm. Smells like a beer. Cheers, everybody, for the second time today. And long might everybody be drinking beer. Who cares? Mmm. Yes, that is really nice again. That is that is another good. Is it organic beer, then? Because it, it's organic, does it taste better? The last two that I've had have tasted really, really good. Um, 
I don't know. I'm unsure about that. I know there's not a lot of um, chemicals in beers these days because of all the regulations and everything. But the, these last two that have been claimed, that, that have been classed as organic, have been really, really good indeed. <coughs> pardon me, I do beg your pardon. <coughs> That's what beer does, you see. It creates a happiness that has to come out through your mouth, not just through words. I'm very happy, as you can probably tell. <laughs> oh, I've got spots of beer all over my glasses. Never mind. This is a... This is not quite so much a pale ale, I don't think. This is more a bitter than a pale ale. And it's very nice indeed. Not much dissimilar to the one I had before. Still, you can get the malt in there. You get a slight sweetness from the hops. But it's a good, all-round, well-balanced beer. The five percent probably not as sessionable as the as the Tom Long at three point eight percent. This is five percent, so might have to be a bit more careful with this one. However, I could quite happily sit in a pub and sup that. That is really nice indeed. And again, got it from the shopping night and that I told you about before. And uh, well worth a visit. I'll go back again, get some more of that. I'll certainly go back and get see if they've got any any Stroud Brewery in. <clears throat> we all know Sammy Smith's long-standing uh, Yorkshire brewer. Of course, John Smith, Sammy Smith's, Black Sheep, Theakstons, they're all intertwined, aren't they? They're all Yorkshire. That is lovely. Very slight toffee caramel notes in there. Very, very slight as you're getting sort of halfway down the glass. But it just adds to the flavour of the beer. I love it. It is it's a, two good beers on the trot. I can't mm, can't fault it, can we? Can't fault it. That is really nice. So, Sammy Smith, pale ale, disguised as a bitter. Or oh, a bitter disguised as a pale ale, I should say. Yeah. I need a new chair. <coughs> Pardon me. Lovely stuff. Anyway, so here's to all, everybody out there who enjoys a beer. Especially all the beer tubers that I enjoy watching. And that's all of you. I do watch most of you. But there's so little time and so many videos. Uh, I've been watching some this morning. Um, yeah, just just find out, just see what's on my subscribe list and just go on subscribe to them while you're subscribing to me us me and her yes I love it anyway cracking beer find it if you can test it try it and I'm going to enjoy this so we'll see you in the week all being well um, I'm, I'll probably go and have uh, a couple more <clears throat> around the place watch a bit of telly got a couple of jobs to do and um, might even practice some bass. It's a good day. Cheers, everybody. Nice to see you all. Please take care and be excellent to each other. <laughs>